Refuse brought to the plant is weighed and then discharged into the refuse bunker. Bulky wastes such as tree trunks and furniture are cut or crushed to small pieces. The refuse is mixed thoroughly in the bunker using overhead grab cranes and then charged into the furnaces from the top. Auxiliary oil burners are used only to start up the combustion. Once the refuse is fired and the furnace temperature maintained, the combustion of the refuse is sustained without the need for auxiliary fuel. The burning refuse is mixed, agitated and moved downwards by the moving stoker grate. Preheated air drawn from the refuse bunker is introduced through the underside of the grate. The normal operating temperature in the furnace is about 1000 degrees Celsius. The flue gas produced in the combustion process flows through the broiler to generate superheated steam which is used to generate electricity. The flue gas is cooled and then passes through a dry lime reactor and an electrostatic precipitator which will remove up to 85% HCI and 99.5% of the dust content in the flue gas. The flue gas is finally discharged to the atmosphere via chimneys that are 150 meters tall. The ash or residue from the furnace is transported to the ash pit via vibrating conveyors. Ferrous metals are picked up from the ash by overhead electromagnetic separators and sold as scrap.